Welcome back everyone. Today I'm going to be installing my cylinders into my uh, cylinder barrels uh, for my Great Plains 2276 engine. Um, I think in my previous video I mentioned that I stripped a spark plug in my heads. So I just decided to go ahead and do an overhaul. Uh, my engine only has 120 hours on it. But since uh, I was doing that and it was cheap enough, I just decided to do a top overhaul and um, go from there before I go flying. Um, but, you know, refer to your assembly manual, but it's pretty basic. You got five rings here and you got to line them up in certain positions where the gaps are. You measure your gaps. You take your rings off, measure your gap inside the barrel and make sure it's within limits. And then you set these ring gaps at different, you know, 12 o'clock, 8 o'clock, whatever your directions say. I already have mine set up. So it just basically, I already lubed my uh, barrel with some motor oil. And it just slamming them in there. Well, not slamming. You don't want to slam them. But um, basically I got this um, ring compressor. And uh, I don't know, I got this like $10 at AutoZone. Uh, it works pretty good. Uh, for what it is. It's a little tricky at first, but once you get the hang of it, it's not that bad. But just slide that on. And then it comes with a, you know, a square Allen type key. And leave about a quarter inch gap at the bottom is what's worked best for me. And then just uh, compress these piston rings. So, a little bit, probably maybe half an inch up, hanging out the bottom, but that's fine. It should seat. Um, if it doesn't, we'll try again. <laughs> the important thing is not to force anything here. You know, you don't want to, you know, mar up the side of your barrels. I mean, that would be bad. <laughs> You're looking at new barrels at that point. But they're cheap enough, so if you do screw up, you know, it's not that expensive. Kind of why I went with the Sonics, um, the Volkswagen engine, is, uh, you know, the parts are cheap to replace. I mean, you compare it to like a Lycoming motor, and just to overhaul, you're looking in the, you know, 15 to 20 grand, if not more. You know, you could overhaul this thing for, you know, maybe a couple grand. So, not bad. Not a bad deal. You know, just got to maintain your engine. And don't run those cylinders too high, um, cylinder head temps too high. But it should be tight enough. Um, I just got the blunt end of a mallet, and I'm just gonna put firm pressure and push straight down, and they should seat. Uh, I'm gonna give this a little bit more tight if I can. Maybe one more click. And they should go down. I might have to. Hit it a little bit. And it's in. There. Easy peasy. And that arrow's pointing towards the flywheel, however, which way you have your uh, barrel set up. But yeah, I hope you're enjoying the videos. I plan on making a lot more. I'm new to this, so, you know, bear with me. <laughs> um, but thanks. Uh, if you like the videos, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll uh, see you in the next one.